Hey guys, welcome back to another Rybread19 video. First off, if you're returning from my other videos, you may be noticing something. I know, Megamind. I did get a haircut. That's besides the point. Today's video is all about a British reality TV show. Some of you might have heard of it, some of you might not. It's called Naked Attraction. For those of you who have been on a date or are currently with your partner, just imagine that first time you went out together. Think about how magical it was, getting to know them, talking, maybe eating dinner. Imagine how fun that all was. And now imagine it if you were both naked. Basically, Naked Attraction is a show where a contestant comes on and they see the bottom part of six people completely naked. They then eliminate one person and the next round starts. The next round, it goes up a little bit more and you see more of their body until eventually it comes down to the last person and they decide who they want to pick. So basically, it's the greatest reality show to ever exist. They've just started their seventh season and I thought, hey, why not let the people know about this? So I guess we should just get right into it. I'm Leanne, I'm 54, I live in Folkestone, and as you can tell, I'm an Aussie. So the first contestant of this episode is 54-year-old Leanne. As you can tell, she lives in Aussie. I enjoyed a successful career as a dentist in Australia. She's a retired dentist, so obviously she knows her way around the mouth. Actually, I don't even know if that's a good thing, to know your way around the mouth. It's just, it's just teeth, tongue, and cheeks. Since being divorced, it's like I've discovered my sexuality and become a little bit more sexual. I love to imagine this shot right here. They were like, all right, Leanne, you're gonna be, you're gonna be drinking, you're gonna be like a little flirty, and then you realize you're sucking on a cock straw. I just did not know how to go about dating. I don't know how to date. So maybe I should get on a reality show where I'm just naked with other naked people and I pick who I want to fuck. Date. So this is the part of the show where it raises up. I'm about to be slapped in the face by six wieners. What the oh, fuck? No. Sus. But I will be censoring them for you guys. Very nice. It just, it so slowly goes from wiener to wiener. Let's go over to pink. Very nice girth. Very nice girth. Okay, it is it is kind of girthy. Not really after anything too big. Sex is about pleasure, isn't it? Exactly. So, so she doesn't want too large of a penis, essentially. Um, I will be saying though, this man's penis is not large. Just a little girthy. Rudd's penis slightly got an angle going on there. Yeah, but once it's in there, the angle straightens to where it's in. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Once it's in there, the angle doesn't really matter. It just straightens the way you want it, right? Well, being a dentist, oral is very important to me. <laughs> Queen of the blowjob. <laughs> I would like to be. Okay. <laughs> Hang on, Red's just going bananas. <laughs> what the fuck did I just have to see? There is never a time where it's acceptable to show a penis and then show a penis dancing like a weirdo. Are you prepared to show us? Yep. All right, uh, I guess the men can look away for this section and the girls can watch. I guess there's about to be a lesson in how to give a blue job. Blimey, Leanne. Oh, what do you think of this penis? Very nice. There is a smallest penis here. And I'm not, I'm not the kind of guy that's gonna go, oh, this guy's got the smallest penis. Orange. You are saying goodbye to Jeff. He's 49. He's a customer service advisor from me. Come and say hi. Nice to meet you, Jeff. I've seen your dick. Get together, but thank you very much for the compliments about my young penis. They show me his dick. And then they really, they really don't have to show me his bum walking away. Yo, Blue's got a nipple piercing. I think I just changed who I want to win. Around the nipples, just spray a little bit of cream. Grandma? Mm -hmm. Yeah. A couple of strawberries on top. Pop a strawberry down. On top or inside? Inside. You've got to make them work. A strawberry. I mean, good for you, Leanne. That's awesome. In your I don't know if I'm ever going to eat strawberries again. Like a magnum sort of ice cream <laughs> before? She fucked herself with an ice cream. This is the stuff I don't need to know, Leanne. I love food play. Great, you could have stopped there. When it comes to food and sex, the rule should really be, don't put it in. That's it. 
Don't put it in. I'm not, I'm not a kink shamer. You do your food stuff if you want. But ew. Spicy foods won't mm. spice up your sex life as much as dry out the mucous membranes and cause chemical burns. This show shouldn't be the way you find out that you shouldn't put hot peppers inside of you. Don't. Like a guy really creamed up. So many foods are just ruined for me. You know, Christmas is coming up too. I'm gonna make a hot cocoa. I'm gonna put the marshmallows on. I'm gonna get really excited. I'm gonna pull out the whipped cream and then I'm gonna throw up. Also, there's no way to make a dick look tasty. Blue. No! Why blue? He's probably too slender. Leanne, you are saying goodbye to Jason. He's a 47 year old carpenter. Get the fuck out of here! Man. You know, Jason's got the whole package and a nipple ring. I didn't realize being too ripped was a bad thing. I don't gotta see their bums! I love how I'm just seeing wieners this whole time and I'm like, oh, that's a, that's a girthy wiener, blah, blah, blah. And then I see a bum and I'm like, oh, a bum? I've been told I look like Simon Pegg. Hmm. I don't know who the fuck told you you look like Shaun of the Dead, but they were lying. I did get told I was like uh, Jason Statham. I don't know who the fuck told you you look like Jason Statham, but they were lying. Well, several people have said that I look like Johnny Depp. I can actually see Johnny Depp. I can Depp. see that. And I don't know who the fuck told you you look like Johnny Depp, but you look like Weird Al. Maybe today I'll get to sail away with the booty. Charming. Oh my god. Now, remember, the next time they see you, it's with that kit off, Leanne. Get your slingbacks off. So this is the part where Leanne goes into the back and takes off her clothes and comes out naked. Lee. You're going to I kind of knew it was gonna be him. Well, I thought your creaming needed a little bit of work. Yeah, definitely. So, so then, you know, the contestant gets picked and they go on a date together with clothes. Whether it was to be taken seriously or funny, I thought it was a nice little touch. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> there are a few things regarding magnums. And they're gonna eat fucking ice cream bars now. You cheeky dogs. Ah uh, yes, so now we get an update two weeks later to see if the relationship hit it off, or it was just not vibing. On the date I felt like we did feel quite comfortable and there was a little bit of flirting and um, laughter and a bit of fun there. Lee did want to stay in touch, but yeah, distance was a big barrier. So that's Naked Attraction. I hope you all enjoyed. I hope none of you are scarred. You can find some of these episodes online. You can find some of them on YouTube. Please watch at your own discrepancy. Thank you for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you like, subscribe, share with your friends, and come back for more videos. I enjoy doing this. I'll see you guys soon in the next video. Goodbye!